rather busy at the moment. There's the latest figures at Bulli. Here's Matt Hill. Metres maiden here. Red's the favourite. Set. Racing on the inside, Lil Shandy away well, showing speed. Dreamy Olivia going forward. Out wide, Buckaroo showing pace as well. Not too far away, Phoenician Gold. Off the back, Buckaroo goes to the lead from Dreamy Olivia. Then Phoenician Gold back in the field. Lil Shandy, exquisite wind and stumped as they corner. Dreamy Olivia on the inside of Buckaroo. And on the inside, getting through as Lil Shandy. Just in front, Dreamy Olivia. Buckaroo on the outside, joins it. Just about got it. Buckaroo, Dreamy Olivia, nothing in it. Lil Shanty, third stump, fourth. They were followed by Phoenician Gold back behind them. Bohemian Jane, Yvette Bale, one of the last ones to finish with exquisite wind. Photo of Bulline still awaiting that decision at Geelong. And numbers are... Start has got the light on. Now another one, Alan... So Matthew Hill. Owned and trained by Chris Edwards, the last start winner at Goulburn over the 350 metres. And of the others, 8-10 for Bo Brandy, who was the last start winner here in 23 and 35, scoring by half a head. Field about to be locked away. Second race, a grade five over 400 metres. And they're coming forward. Moving forward for the second race. Just about all in. Head shaker being locked away out wide. Green lights are on. Set race number two. You go Fury, the favourite, the blue, at $2.30 now. They're set to go. Racing, you go Fury away well. The inside, Diamond Shiraz away quickly, splitting them. Bo Brandy's up there too on the first corner. Bo Brandy leads by a half. You go Fury, two lengths on show dancer. Diamond Shiraz, a gap pretty girl. Lisa Royal Prince followed by Head Shaker and Prospectus. Around the corner, you go Fury just in front of Bo Brandy. The inside, Diamond Shiraz, on show dancer down the outside. You go Fury, Bo Brandy. Bo Brandy kicks and Bo Brandy won it by two lengths. You go Fury, on show dancer followed by Diamond Shiraz. Back behind them, Head Shaker, Royal Prince prospectus and pretty girl lisa towards the back of the field bo brandy too good in 23 and 13 23 and 13 bo brandy and hugo fury swinging for home together honcho dancer out wider on the course but bo brandy's been able to kick away and score comprehensively by a couple of lengths on the line three has beaten four and five with fourth going to number one diamond shiraz three four five splits of 666 and 1644, 23 and 13 the run. Okay, Matt, three, four, five numbers in the second at Bulli, five. Five over 400 metres. Some Joe and Mr. Hollywood, the main two in it, according to putters. Some Joe, 340, Mr. Hollywood, 360. Green lights on, set to go, third race. Ready to go. Racing, oh, pinging the lids. Mr. Hollywood landed length in front off the mat from Red Dirt Girl and Silver Adonis the Reserve going forward. Two further back, Shezza's Charm checked out the back. Rapid subject going past at some Joe Jacko Shadow and Bronte Blue as they come to the corner. Mr. Hollywood led. Oh, ran Silver Adonis off the track. Shezza's Charm got through along with Red Dirt Girl. They're across the track and bursting through. Some Joe, the favourite from nowhere, will beat them all. Some Joe's won it from Silver Adonis, Shezza's Charm. Then Mr. Hollywood, Red Dirt Girl back behind them. Bronte Blue towards the back of the field pulling up quickly rapid subject and it was one of the last ones with Jacko shadow also towards the back five nine and five three nine and five those numbers some Joe the winner three thirty two ten about to be called up Mount Barker for the being called over being called over race number four Favourite home there at Geelong. Thanks, Dan. De Bulli for the fourth. Luca at 160. Outrageous stream at 590 and 644. Nasty Nana. And the field being called in. This over the 400. Interesting race. Luca going for a hat trick of wins here with wins at Richmond over the 330 and 400. Green lights on. Set for the fourth. Luca at $1.70. Race number four. Set to go. Racing Luca the inside away fairly jumping well was cooled down lands a half in front of outrageous dream nasty Nana two and a half Luca followed by ragtime lad pro am last of all is Brunanti off the back cool down kicks away two lengths in front Luca in hot pursuit rail ran wide there the favourite getting through as nasty Nana cool down kicks Luca down the outside cool down has a big break though it'll score cool down two and a half Luca third ragtime lad fourth nasty Nana then Brunanti back behind them was pro am and outrageous dream last of the seven. 413 will be the numbers in 22 and 98. 
Number four, cool down at 9.70. And 5.20, Luca, who went off the track coming around the home corner. And third to number three, Ragtime Lad. Fourth to number eight, Nasty Nana. Four, one, three and eight, two and a half by a length and three quarters the margins. Cool down. A bit of a blowout there for punters at 9.70 and 5.20. Defeated the hot pot favourite who wanted to track wide as it wheeled for home. 120 and Ragtone Lab was in third. 22.90. By Roman Realm next to last and last of all was Nickelodeon. Last two quarters, 30 and 8, 29 seconds. Set to run. Racing Dr. Narrowly on the inside. Ping landed two lengths in front of Slim Secret, followed by Sudden Surprise. Out wider was Puzzling Riddle. Around the outside, Organic Boy is improving along with Aussie Spencer on the rail. Out the back, Ginger Mate JB's Camilla. Dr. Narrowly leads by two and a half. Slim Secret, followed by Aussie Spencer. Sudden Surprise, they swing. Dr. Narrowly leads by four to Slim Secret. Down the outside, Aussie Spencer. Dr. Narrowly clear, though. A smart one wins it by four lengths. Dr. Narrowly from Aussie Spencer. Slim Secret. They were followed by Organic Boy back behind them. Sudden surprise, JB's Camilla. And uh, that was one of the last ones to complete the course. Back there somewhere, puzzling riddle. 26.89 the time. 26.89. Number 10, Dr. Narrowly has bolted in. $150, $1.4. Aussie Spencer, $2.20. Slim Secret, $3.30. And $26.89 and for Jody Gilbert. It's now put up five straight. At a short quote. 150 a dollar four. Aussie Spencer 220 and Slim Secret at 330. Cronella paid 530. The exact is 630 and the trifecta 4730. Easy win there, Nadia. No doubt at all about that, Matt. Yes, big effort. Doctor narrowly the reserve. There was strong market support to suggest it would run a big race. 150 a dollar and four. Obviously, a big benefit with the scratchings. It actually first gaining a start and then drawing the red. Big plus. Just a one to follow. 10, 2 and 4. 26.89 was the race time. Let's have a look at the updated markets. Dr Delvine dominates betting ahead of the 8 Lucy Lou. Following Bulli, we'll be back to Bathurst for race 5. No... Moving forward, Dr Delvine going into box number 2. And they're just about set to run. Now they're all in. Green lights on, grade five over the 5.15, second leg of the daily double. They're ready to go. Stand by. Racing, Dr. Delvina away fairly, goes back to second last, showing speed, the centre diamond is Mur with the return gift the inside. Return gift kicks away, two lengths in front of Knighted Railing through Diamond is Mur. Then Fire Havoc around the outside, Nadine's victory. Back in the field, Dr. Delvine's about to get underneath a few of them. And then Lucy Lou, and towards the back of the field was Bingara Gem. They swing return gift in front, two and a half lengths in front of Knighted in hot pursuit. A gap, Nadine's victory. Return gift leads by three, Knighted won't get it. Return gift, two good wins from Knighted and Dr. Delvine out of the pack late for third from Lucy Lou Nadine's victory. Towards the rear was Bingara Gem, Diamond Ismer and Fire Havoc last of all. One, four and two across the line. Return gift in 29 and 76. 29 and 76. Return gift at 12.40 and 1.80. Knighted at 2.90 and Dr. Delvine at $1.40. It's one, four, two and seven. Three lengths the winning margin with three lengths between second and third. Three by three, 29, 76, one, four, two and seven across the line in race number six on the card at Bulleye. Now the uh, green light activated, $3 poetic portrait. Stand by for a start, seventh at Bulleye, ready, Racing, poetic portrait from the inside away fairly, jumping quickly was Love Girl, trying to cross over, Bingara Bandit hunting up underneath it, they land two lengths in front of Parisian, then poetic portrait as they come off the back, around the outside, Quality Wish checked out the back, Will he go far, with Freight Man and Paul's pick as they corner, the front runner Bingara Bandit by two and a half lengths, Parisian, and in hot pursuit down the outside, Love Girl kicking Bingara Bandit two lengths in front, Parisian coming at it and Paul's pick flashing, Paul's pick gets up and wins it, Paul's pick from Bingara are bad at Parisian. They were followed by Freightman Poetic Portrait pulling up quickly towards the back of the field. Quality Wish, Love Girl and Willie Go Far. Number three, Paul's Pick. Out past the centre, charging home after Bingara Bandit and Parisian. And Paul's Pick has finished over the top of them. 7.30 and 2.30 in a time of 27.53. Numbers are 3, 6, 8 and 2. 3, 6, 8 and 2, the numbers. Margins... Uh, three quarters of a length by three quarters of a length. 
three quarters by three quarters, 27.53 the run. Paul's pick, having its second race start tonight, has got the money. This one, and they're all in. Green lights are on, favourite, equal favourites now. The four and the seven, both at 3.20. Ready race eight, set. Racing, jumping well, Casino Card, the inside, Lulu Fly going forward with Michael's Wish out wide. They land a length and a half in front of Wilson, Binjang, Flash Peter, towards the back of the field, Kazmix Wish. Check there was Flash Peter, bad trouble, going back, Casino Card, no hidden tears back with them. Racing away, Michael's Wish up to the corner, put up seven. Two in second, Flash Peter, who's making up ground again, from Kazmix Wish and Wilson, Binjang. In the straight, Michael's Wish well clear, bolts in. Michael's Wish clearly from Kazmix Wish and Flash Peter. Wilson, Binjang behind them from Winsome Duchess a gap to no hidden tears towards the back Lulu Fly Casino card was poleaxed off the back seven Michaels wish 360 190 Kazmix wish at 180 flash Peter a dollar 10 2678 the run 2678 Michaels wish too good Jody Gilbert double for her she had that smart greyhound win earlier on in the night the reserve I speak of Dr. Narrowly and Michael's Wish clearing the pack. There was bad trouble off the back and Michael's Wish said to goodbye. 2678, this is Superfecta race. Numbers are 7, 3, 4, 5, 8 and 6. 7, 3, 4, 5, 8 and 6. Well, race 9, grade 5 over the 472. They're all in. There's the green lights. Shane's flash at $1.70. Set to go. Race nine. Off the inside. Shane's flash away fairly. Jolly Swagman began fast driving up underneath it. It was a Malone. They land two lengths in front of Shane's flash, followed by Dare to Shine and Passing Glory. Back behind them is Air Power towards the back. Popular advice and Winding Rivers. They corner Malone. Kicks away. Two lengths in front of Shane's flash. They were followed by Passing Glory and Jolly Swagman. In front, Malone down the outside. Shane's flash with work to do it. Won't get it. Malone's going to win easily. Malone by three and a half. Shane's flash and Passing Glory. A gap job. Jolly Swagman, followed by Dare to Shine. Back behind them, popular advice, and the last two to finish, Winding Rivers and Air Power. 26 and 90, the run. To Malone, 940, 170. Kicking away off the top corner. Shane's Flash, two and a half lengths away. 10, 24, 20, 02, the sectionals. Margins three and a quarter by a half length. Three and a quarter by a half length, 26 and 90. And the numbers are 2, 1, 5 and 6. 2, 1, 5 and 6 after race 9. Well, Malone's now at uh, 3.20, 3.80 for Token de Moore. Plenty given a hope in this. It's quite an open race to end the night. Good luck with your selections here. They're all in. Green lights on. 10th from Bulai. Grade 5 over the 4.72. Jabrina's best now at $3.10. Set the 10th. Racing Jabrina's best away fairly. Lennox Bale, the inside, began fast. Burrowing through Jabrina's best as they head towards the turn off the back. Making ground on the outside. Awesome gun. And then came Shez's title around the outside. Drew Barry with token to Moore out the back. Now Shez's title up to the turn. Lennox Bale drive up on the inside. Just leads Jabrina's best out wide. Drew Barry and getting up on the inside. Token to Moore across the track. Jabrina's best hits the front. Getting up on the inside. Token to Moore out wide. Drew Barry! Photo token to more possibly from Jabrina's best Drew Barry. Three way go, great finish. Chick Magnet fourth, followed by Shizza's title. Towards the back, Lennox Bale, another champ, an awesome gun. Getting right up on the inside, token to more. At 380 and 240, possibly here from Jabrina's best and Drew Barry. And they are the numbers 7, 2, and 3. 7, 2, and 3 in 27, 36. 7, 2, 3, and 6. It's a neck by a neck in the end. A neck by a neck, 7-2 and 3 in the closing race at Bulleye. Good finish. Denise Warren, the owner-trainer of Token de Moore. Two uh, wins from four starts now. And it's taken it at 380 and $2.40. 7-2 and 3, official 27 and 36. It's been a good night of Greyhound Racing. Certainly hope you've found a winner. Couple of highlights. Good win by the reserve in the fifth earlier on, Dr. Nara Lee, and uh, probably a greyhound to watch from earlier. Silver Adonis was a good thing beaten. Good night. Okay, Matt, thanks for your